and what are the constituent of nuclear envelope outer nuclear membrane inner nuclear membrane perinuclear space that is uh, the distance uh, the, the compartment between the inner and outer or uh, nuclear mem uh, envelope nuclear pores are present here and nuclear lamina structures are also found there Okay, nuclear pores are small pore like structures which are present here you can see nuclear pores these are nuclear pores here uh, well, it is not mentioned here but uh, these are the pores these are the nuclear pores that we can see and apart from the pores we have this lamina structures known as nuclear lamina which we are going to see in a moment. So, the outer so the very first thing here about the nuclear envelope is the outer nuclear membrane O N M what is outer nuclear membrane how it looks like you can see this picture of outer nuclear membrane this is the nucleus nucleoplasm uh, and nucleolus this is nucleolus and this is the outer nuclear membrane you can see that uh, it contains a lot of dotted structure those are basically ribosomes we are going to see that in a moment the outer nuclear membrane is continuous with the endoplasmic reticulum it is continuous to the endoplasmic reticulum that means if you start from here this nuclear envelope continues like this so, it becomes endoplasmic reticulum here. These are endoplasmic reticulum. Okay? So, basically there is no difference between the outer nuclear envelope and endoplasmic reticulum. They are continuous in nature. The lumen of nuclear membrane is directly connected to the lumen of ER. Basically, they contain same kind of components, similar kind of proteins after the synthesis. 